Good morning and welcome to the autumn of 2023. Trees already turned red and gold and wind is stronger, the sun is weaker, it got cold and I don't like it. Before temperature go lower than I can take, might as well enjoy the last warmish days of the year. This is really another one of those videos I did not plan to film. I took the bike to the garage for the cold season. I know for a fact I will be missing it like crazy. Can't wait for the spring to come back and the asphalt to get dry. Anyway, and left Bucharest by train. A long, long train ride after which I reached Nantes County, from where we left by car towards the Grahumorlui little town. A long weekend up north in a remote location between the hills of Grahumorlui in a little village I never even heard before called Negrilasa. We rented here a six bedroom villa for the weekend just so we can spend some time with the extended family, have some anniversary celebrations, play some board games and relax in the silence of the area. The place was decorated in a rustic manner keeping the traditional colors and ornaments specific to the Moldavian socio-cultural climate. Oh and how we celebrated! Everyone brought tons of traditional food, we had tree cakes, the long evenings playing fun games with the family took us laughing hard until past midnight. It was truly one of those rare occasions where we were able to disconnect and spend some quality time doing what Romanians usually do during such occasions. The following day. Good morning and welcome to Arinish Adventure Park. We are in Gurahumorului. It's somewhere near a high hill or mountain or something like that it's autumn there's a lot of stuff to do here let's see if we can jump on that huge zipline Observatory is steeper than we expected, a bit more solicitating if you haven't done this in a while, and uh, we are not even there yet. We are up into the skiing side of the hill in the winter time. There's skiing happening here, down to all the way in the valley. We have to go right up there. A little longer than a few minutes later we finally got here up to the top this is the observatory i'm not sure we're gonna climb the observatory right now although the view is beautiful but the view the panoramic view all around is amazing 
now we're gonna find the point where we have to leave with the zip line. Let's see where is it. I'm seeing a couple of people there. They are also with yellow backpacks like we are, but now we have to find. There's a sign saying Mega Tiroliana. I think that's that way. Let's see. The view is still beautiful up there. Check this out. Loving this forest during autumn view. Let's see where is the zip line. A few minutes later. We are here. We're supposed to go down from up there all the way down there. Uh, it's gonna be fun. Hopefully. We are very tired. It took us what time is it? An hour and maybe 20 minutes, an hour and 40 minutes, something like that. Yep, an hour and 20 minutes. Uh, but I mean, it's worth it because the trail from down there to up here is beautiful. Definitely worth it. We're gonna climb up and we're gonna ride the zipline, baby. One pair of pants later. The ride was better than the last one in the other zipline video on this channel. The Adenish Park has a ton of activities for both kids and adults. I highly recommend this area. We had a blast only by climbing through the forest and then enjoying the huge zipline, or how they call it, Mega Tiroliana Bukovine. Uh, the zipline was the main thing that we wanted to do, but also to climb up to the zipline you can use the cable transportation. We went through the forest, we climbed up, 
about an hour, an hour and 20 minutes, something like that. It was harder than we thought, but it was very beautiful, uh, especially through the forest. We did the zip line. The park itself has a ton of attractions, especially for kids. But you know, there are a lot of things that grown-up people can do. You know, play tennis, rent bikes, uh, go to the park. The park is beautiful down there. There's a river crossing it. You can do a ton of stuff, renting uh, four-wheelers and all that. Uh, the place is beautiful. I definitely recommend go do the mega zip line. Uh, that is beautiful because. Of first part of it is a lot more exciting for everyone than the first one that we did at Palma. If you remember that, if not, go watch the video. Uh, Palma was great, this was even better. Uh, it was taller, it was longer, the speed was uh, uh, a lot better. I mean, I think they, they brag about 150 km per hour. I don't think so because I reached and surpassed 150 km per hour on a bike and um, I don't think it was it was that but definitely close to it or definitely the speed that you have is very entertaining because the views are amazing and it's outstanding to just fly you know through the trees at some point or above the trees and see uh, the view from up there down into the forest paths, trails, rivers, um, cut out trees it's beautiful. You have to go, you have to try it out. Thumbs up, Arinish Park, go check it out. Way too soon after our zipline descent, we went back to Negrilasa for the last barbecue and dinner with the family in precious moments of silence and relaxation. Man, this video was all over the place all the time. So yeah, in short, we are... Hey, I'm filming here. Dude. Probably the last occasions during this summer when it's still kind of warm and you can go around and uh... stuff like that disturbing the peace sometimes not all the time but yeah probably the last time when you can actually go and spend a weekend in a beautiful countryside of uh, northern Romania it's beautiful it's kind of warm the weather is still on our side soon that's not going to be the case The next morning Good morning, good morning We slept well uh, Beginning of a new day, kind of chilly, kind of cloudy today Hopefully weather is gonna be back on track with sunny and clear skies We shall see This is it, we are on the road now Feel free house, thank you for welcoming us, we are gone, this is the day, bye.